the default mail app on iOS has received quite a few add-ons over the last few years, and most iPhone users stick with it to send or receive emails. But what if the mail app stops receiving emails? If you are facing the same issue, here's how to fix it. First of all, you should try to refresh the inbox manually on your iPhone. To do that, open the mail app on your iPhone and swipe down from the top to refresh the contents of your inbox. If your iPhone won't receive new emails, it might be possible that you have denied mobile data access to the default mail app. In that case, you need to allow data access to the mail app. To do that, open the settings app on your iPhone. Then scroll down to tap on mail. Enable the mobile data toggle from the following menu. Now go back to the mail app and see if it resolves the issue. If connectivity is not the issue, then the next thing that you should check is the sync settings for the inbox. To check and manage these options, go to the settings app on your iPhone and scroll down to tap on mail. Tap accounts and select fetch new data. Turn on the toggle beside push. Do note that you should ideally go for the push option. If it's not available, use the fetch function and set a short interval frequency to get new emails. Refresh the mail app to see if the issue gets resolved. The notification settings might also be causing an issue in the background. To fix that, you'll need to check the notification settings for the mail app on your iPhone. To do that, go to the settings app on your iPhone and scroll down to tap on mail. Now tap on notifications and then tap on allow notifications. Under notification delivery, select immediate delivery. Now check the mail app to see if the issue is fixed. If your mails are not syncing properly, then it might be possible that your mail account settings are outdated or you might have recently changed passwords for the same. If that is the case, then you need to remove your account and add it again to sync properly. To do that, open the Settings app on iPhone and scroll down to select Mail. Select Accounts. Tap the account that needs fixing. Select Delete Account and confirm your decision. Now return to Accounts and add a new account. Check if the issue is resolved after adding the account again. If the issue still persists, then it might be possible that the Mail app on your phone is out of date. Mail is part of iOS software on iPhone. Apple updates all the default apps with the major iOS updates. To fix that, go to Settings, then General, and tap on Software Updates. If a new update is available, then iOS will do the needful and update the Mail app with the new update. The Mail app is like any other app and can also malfunction or act up. The good thing is, Apple finally lets you delete default apps on your iPhone. So if a specific app is acting up, you can remove the app and install it again from the App Store. To do that, long press on the Mail app icon and select Remove App. Now tap on Delete App. Now to reinstall the app, launch the App Store, search for Mail, and install it on your phone. Finally, if all the above solutions are not working, then you might consider changing the mail client on your iPhone to send and receive messages. Mail isn't the only email app on iPhone. The App Store is packed with capable email apps to choose from. Among them, Gmail and Outlook are the two best mail alternatives. Hopefully, you are now able to successfully send and receive emails on your iPhone. If you like this guide, Make sure to follow and subscribe to Guiding Tech for more tutorials related to your everyday technology. And make sure to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.